You're insecure because you believe in yourself. Now, what do I mean by this? So, let's break it down. What the fuck is insecurity? So, say for example, there's something that you represented. Say something about your clothes you're wearing, you know, basic insecurity. Say that you went to school or went out in public wearing some kind of outfit and you liked it, you know what I mean? You're like, oh, hell yeah, I'm fresh, you know what I mean? I like this, I got I got these colors on. But then your friends or local friend group, right when they see you, be like, what are those? You know what I mean? Like, what kind of shoes are those, bro? What kind of fucking jacket you got on, bro? What the fuck kind of shit are you wearing? That shit's whack. And then, like, right there, boom. Is where the fucking insecurity starts and it develops. So you originally liked your clothes, but then when you went out in public, the public didn't validate it for you. So out of survival, you uh, you change your preferences. You know what I mean? So like insecurity is like a survival survival instinct. So originally you believed in yourself and you believed in the clothes and the outfit that you're wearing. But when you went out into public, public denied you of it because of their own insecurities. But the public denied you of what you originally believed in in yourself. So then it formed a level of uncertainty. How should I maneuver through the world? You know, I don't want to av- I want to avoid experiences of people making fun of me or I want things to go smoothly. You know what I mean? So you develop a sense of insecurity and then you just accommodate and adapt. So like, yeah, insecurity is because you believe in yourself. So say that you make some music and you like it. You believed in yourself. You believe that this is a music that you like. But then you show your friends or people and they're like, oh, that shit's whack. You know what I mean? It didn't match with their preferences. It it creates a sense of insecurity. Now, I'm not saying 100% of the time. I'm just I'm just giving an example, you know? So, like, uh, no matter what, like, insecurity is based off of, like, Oh, I originally believed in myself, but the outside world didn't validate my original self-belief. So now I form an insecurity in order to, uh, you know, compensate for that for next time. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not, I'm not secure with that. I'm not, I'm not fully confident in myself, you know, whatever, whatever created the insecurity. These are just examples. And like, this is, this is situational. This is, uh, this isn't general. All insecurities like this, but majority of insecurity is because you believed in yourself you know like this is insecurity as far as like uh seeking validation there's other forms of uh insecurity but yeah like say say even if you're like uh, even if you're overweight you know if you're unhealthy and you want to be unhealthy that's fine that's internal battle but say like you know you you feel good about yourself you like the way you look in the mirror but then like people make you feel like you're fat you know like people you hear shit that people say or like uh, you see like like skinny people are praised in the fucking uh, pictures and shit and commercials and shit you know what I mean so you you might not feel uh, too good about yourself for being fat you know but a ri- you were chilling before you saw that like the models get the praise you know you were chilling until you saw that like oh wait I'm supposed to be this muscular swimsuit fucking model for as a male or a woman I'm supposed to be this freaking skinny twig chick that's on the freaking a Victoria's Secret ads, you know what I mean? Like, or even other way around. Oh, I'm skinny girl, and I'm supposed to be this freaking thick, freaking overly proportioned freaking female that I see in the music videos, you know what I mean? It goes both ways, you know? So originally, you believed in yourself. You're like, I didn't think I was skinny. I believed in myself. Or I didn't think I was overweight. I believed in myself. But now I've been presented with something that tells me that what I believed in myself isn't what I should believe in. So it creates insecurity. Does that make sense? So I find this very useful. I feel like this is a very, very useful tip that people could use. It's like, wait, I'm not actually insecure. I actually believe in myself and I'm trying to match my beliefs with the validation of the outside world. No, 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 no. You don't need to do that. You need to match your fucking shit with nothing, you know? If you believe in yourself, you believe in yourself. Don't seek validation through other people. So, insecurity is okay, you know, as long as you're dealing with it. But just remember, if you're insecure, it's because you believe in yourself.